The Victoria Farmers Market held its last market of 2020 Saturday. It plans to return the first Saturday of January. New Center 25's Carolina Strain spoke with a vendor new to the market. Even though rain chances were high Saturday, that didn't stop the Victoria Farmers Market from continuing. The rain kind of scared folks off. I think we'd get people and then it would start to rain and they would leave. But Jason Warwas, a Victoria resident, was new to the market as a vendor. I know a lot of folks have older knives that you just can't buy anymore. And, and you, sometimes they just sit because they're not sharp enough or they're not cleaned up. or So I do all that kind of stuff. And hopefully to get that out there and let more people know that those old knives that they've had for years and years, we can bring them back to life. Warwas was given a forage as a gift from his wife in February. It kind of took on a life of its own. He hopes to also educate the youth. Uh, I plan on this summer trying to maybe get some people who are interested, some younger kids, uh, just teach them the basics because I, I think uh, blacksmithing is a, is a dying art and uh, it's just something that once you know how to do it, I mean, you can do it. It doesn't take a bunch of expensive tools. The farmer's market is run by the food bank of the Golden Crescent. The focus of the market is to provide local fresh food to the community and to support local farmers and businesses, which means they limit the number of artisans to one per five food vendors. Warwas's craft as a knife maker and sharpener works hand in hand with the preparation and eating of food. For your hometown news, I'm Carolina Strain.